N-U-P! Everywhere! N-U-P! Everywhere! N-U-P! Everywhere! N-U-P! Everybody! N-U-P! People power. power! Our power! Our power! People power! People power! Our power! Our power! People power! In every constituency where we have one, more than one people power slash NUP contender, because we are not each other's enemies. We are trying to sweep away NRM and its dictatorial tendencies from Kampala, from Uganda. So, ladies and gentlemen, again, I'm very honored to welcome a colleague who was one of the first few people that joined me, even without in, in, uh, invitation, in the Chadondo East constituency. This gentleman, even though he has uh, challenges with his physicality, ran on foot with me in the Chadondo East election, taught me so much about politics and about elections. And this is none other than Mayor Balimwezo from Nakawa. That you chaired yesterday. Believe me, you, my brother and I are going to sit and come out with uh, something that is good that people of Nakawa will appreciate. There is no way that any other party is going to take Nakawa seats. And I believe both of the seats are going to be taken by any of you. I've, uh, I've done what we call equity. When I, when, I, when I was in leadership, I've tried to make sure that I balance both constituencies. I've been everywhere. And as such, I can go anywhere in the constituency. So it will be upon me to select which constituency I go to. Because I know I can win in every constituency. And um, after, after negotiations, basically we shall, uh, we shall, we shall, we shall uh, come back and report. And we shall begin supporting each other. Yes, I'm uh, not the kind who really, you know, buys the idea of let's keep splitting our country into little pieces. Every village uh, is becoming a district nowadays. It's very problematic because if you say that the issue is service delivery, deliver the services. What people want is services. So you cannot say that this district is very big. There's one hospital on this end and one school. So let's split it such that we can put another hospital and school the other side. Build the school already. Build the hospital already. Why do you have to split and then cost of administration goes high and all these different things. So yes, I was uh, going for Nakawa, the whole of it, and I had no problem. I was ready every and everywhere. Uh, but they have split it. And so that means I can only go one side because I'm based in Bukoto too, so, which is in Nakawa West. Uh, yes, you talked about that meeting with our comrade, uh, Mayor Balimwezo. He's based in uh, West in Mutungo. And uh, so that's the discussion we really were having, such that I keep to one side, he keeps to the other side. Because it's important that we don't get to, to fight and have friction. We are all comrades and we are all interested in change. So what normally happens, actually, the splitting happens, they do it to try and create room for NRM MPs and all of that. When an NRM MP or minister becomes weak, they now carve out and leave him in a small area for him to manage very easily and, and all of that. It's, you know, his patronage, gerrymandering, it's very sad, very disturbing. Great day. Today is a day when we receive noble Ugandans who have taken a fundamental decision to stand and identify clearly and firmly with us as the People Power Movement, but most importantly, as the National Unity Platform. We are pleased uh, to know that these ladies and gentlemen are actually confident about identifying with us. Um, these people are people that I personally hold in very high regard. These are people that have been steadfast, they've been consistent, and they continue to be consistent. Um, the Honorable John Baptist Nambeshe is a member of parliament for Manjia County, County in Bududa. This is a gentleman, ladies and gentlemen, that I admired right from when I entered parliament. One, this gentleman came to parliament on the NRM ticket. He has been a noble and solid member of the NRM. Like I wrote in the past on social media, that we do not doubt people that come from the oppressor side to join the forces of change and to stand with the people of Uganda. When we were standing against the blunt abrogation of our constitution in the Toji Kwata Co-Fair, 
the Honorable John Baptist Nambeshe stood on the side of Ugandans. Even when Museveni proved powerful, Yes, please. <laughs> Even when Museveni proved so powerful and so ferocious, the Honorable John Bob continued to stand on the side of Ugandans. He fully represented the voice of the people of Nigeria who elected him. And today I cannot be any prouder to announce that the Honorable John Baptist Nambeshe is becoming a member of the National Unity Platform. <laughs> Honorable John Baptist Nambeshe, it is my absolute honor to present to you your membership card of the National Unity Platform on behalf of the oppressed people of Uganda. And I'm confident that you will continue to stand on their side. Kindly take N -U -P. a and you be everywhere. People power. Our power. Our power. People power. I would like to make my total commitment to the National Unity Party and to you, our principal, and to you, the membership of NUP, and I assure you of full support of not only this and particularly Manjia. Manjia, I must appreciate you right from here, the headquarters of NUP, because you are the people who brought me up this far. But the entire sub-region of Ugisu, to you members who have not known, we have aggressively been reaching out to them, and they are behind the people power. And now NUP, which is the vehicle that is going to drive this movement, Right from this unveiling, I assure you, we have a lot of moral support from the East and particularly from the sub-region of Bukisu. NUP! Everywhere! People power! Our power! God abundantly bless us. Display your card. Display your card. Where? I'm displaying my card. On the other side. I'm so proud to belong to the same political formation with you, Honorable Nambeshe. Ladies and gentlemen, there is this gentleman. He's a born-again Christian. He does not lie, even in the face of danger. The Honorable Nsamba John Patrick. This gentleman we met at Parliament. Everywhere. Honorable Nsamba came to Parliament on the NRM ticket. Until today, he has been a full member of the National Resistance Movement. But like many other noble Ugandans who respect the people more than the rulers, he stood on the side of the people right from the days of Toji Kwatako. He has continued to respectfully disagree with the President, to respectfully we uh, disagree with what is wrong. And today, ladies and gentlemen, I cannot be any prouder to associate with the Honorable Nsamba Patrick Nambeshe. Okay. Sorry, uh, Oshave. Yeah, please, Nambeshe, get out of my brain. <laughs> yeah, the Honorable Nsamba Patrick Oshave, sir, I welcome you. And and it is my own, your membership card of the National Unity Platform, and also <laughs> and so also a brochure of what we stand for. NUP everywhere. NUP everywhere. People power. Our power. Our power. People power. People power. Our power. I am. To work with the Honorable Chagulani Sentamu. He is a man who inspires me. He is a man who inspires many Ugandans. And every Ugandan now down there, they have hope because of Honorable Chagulani Sentamu.
I'm a man who believes in change. I believed in transition within NRM. There was no single hope that within NRM, anybody can talk about standing against President Museveni. I am proud to be part of the biggest political party in Uganda today. The National Unity Platform, it's, very, it's a brand new, biggest, and it is everywhere to the grassroots people. <laughs> NUP is the vehicle for change. We believe 20, Mission 2021 is real. By having this card, I feel I'm touching. I feel I'm already there in Mission 2021. We are going to change Uganda. And we are not going to use guns. We are going to use our power. The power of the people. We must change and send the dictator to rest. The dictator must rest. Now, I want to encourage every member of NRM. I know many of you are uncomfortable with the system. Take a decision like I have taken a decision. Take a decision to be part of Ugandans. Be part of our country. Be part of this movement. A movement determined to, make, to bring a transition in this country using a peaceful means. People power. Our power. Our power. People power. Thank you very much. Brothers and sisters from all formations, including the NRM, we will be your brothers and sisters. We shall welcome you. We shall not call you moles. We shall judge you by your actions. So our doors are open. Please join us. Gentlemen, I'm about to introduce to you, ladies and gentlemen, is a gentleman that I met in Parliament. He's a gentleman that is unborgable. He's a gentleman that inspires me a great deal. And ladies and gentlemen, before you, I introduce the Honorable David Kalwanga from Busuju. Honorable, it's my pleasure and honor to present to you your National Unity Platform membership card and the procure of what we stand for. Thank you. They were looking for say something of whatever is going on. What I can tell you, there's nothing that hurts than lacking a source of belonging. I myself, I came as a member of parliament, but I came as an independent person. From nowhere I met this guy. My boss, you've done it. And I'm happy that now I have a source of belonging. I'm ready and I'm very committed to do whatever it takes. What I can tell you that even yesterday we elected our district executive in Mitiana and I'm sure 100% we are going to perform. Guys, I'm very happy. Thank you very much. I now have where to belong and I'm ready to perform the way I feel I could. Thank you very much. People power. Our power. Our power. People power. NUP. Everywhere. Everywhere. NUP. People. People power. People power. Our power. Everywhere. Mbarara. NUP. Entebbe. NUP. Even here. NUP. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, allow me with utmost confidence, with utmost love, with utmost appreciation, and utmost inspiration, introduce my personal friend who I believe needs no introduction. This young man, and I will not apologize for calling him a young man, because he's indeed a very young man, but with very, very, very strong resolve, very determined very solid. Ladies and gentlemen, I introduce to you none other than the Honorable Zake Francis. Zake! Zivuge! Zake! Zake! Zivuge! Zivuge!
this my friend here, we have survived death I don't know how many times. But God promised us that we shall not die before Uganda is free. That is why for Zake and myself, every risk for the liberation of Uganda is worth it. My brother, my friend, it is my honor to present to you your membership card of the National Unity Platform and a procure that shows what we stand for.